All right, so this bathroom really needs to get cleaned and decluttered. I will put a clip of what I've already started with, but today we're gonna actually go through the rest of everything and fix it, and we're gonna do a deep clean. I'm gonna get rid of this Christmas shower curtain. It is definitely time. And then, I don't know if you guys can see that, but I need to figure out how to clean that. I have asked my husband several times to take that off for me, but he hasn't. So I'm gonna just try to do it myself today, see if I can clean that grate out because it's really nasty. And then this is really embarrassing. But, here is what I found on this window in the bathroom. So I need to bleach the crap out of these windows and really figure out how to get this clean. So I will be doing that. And then again, a quick view of what's in here, but I'm gonna be going through it and really clearing it out and reorganizing everything. And then I've got some new ideas for the closet as well. To really just get in here and get rid of some of the stuff that we're not using, it's just taking up space. This is a very small bathroom. And there are five of us that use it. We only have one bathroom in the house. So I really need to figure out what I'm gonna do. So I picked up a few things that I wanna um, replace in the bathroom just for organization. And I really just...
Yes, I'm gonna put a fly Baby, you give me a bit later You whip up my appetite Don't leave me in
cup of maybe even a little more of baking soda and then add in some vinegar and then I'll end up going through with some boiling hot water for my teapot and let that clear itself out. This is one of the drawers that I had originally started with on a previous day, so I'm just throwing this in here very quickly, and then we will soon get to the rest of the bathroom. And here's what it looked like when it was all done. I decided to get rid of this makeup caddy because one, I didn't use most of the stuff on there. It was literally just sitting there collecting dust. When I cleaned the bathroom, I didn't usually tend to take everything off and clean it, so everything just got dust. <laughs> detangle or anything I have extra that I want to bring into work for patients that don't bring anything with them. and then dividers if I want to use the dividers. So I want to use this for some first aid stuff and then just some of the extra stuff that I have here, like extra makeup, just to get it into one place.
All right, I'm finally done. Here are some of the new decorations. Got a new plant. Some new organization in here. I'm super excited about it. And then we've just got some extra stuff in there. Up in this one, up in this one here, I have my husband's razor. It was always getting dusty before, so this is a lot better. Now I can just keep my lotion and our deodorants in there. That's my retainer. I just don't want to throw it away, even though I'm not using it anymore, but maybe I will eventually. All right, that's that drawer. Now it's really easy to grab a Band-Aid or use some Neosporin. Fully stocked up in here. Keep the soap, extra toothpaste, extra shampoo, conditioner, and then of course toilet paper. And then this was a huge difference. So now I can just grab out my little makeup caddy every day and then put it back so it's not just sitting out on the counter. This here is where the towels go. I just, they're in the wash right now. This thing I absolutely love. I wish I had space. They had a larger one with more cubes, but I just don't have the space for it. But this thing is awesome. You can really categorize everything. It just makes it so much neater to get everything. Keep my extra caps in there, extra toothbrushes. And then in the bottom here, I got rid of that big bin that I was holding all the cleaning stuff in because I felt like it was just a mess. The bottles didn't really fit in there that good. So this way they're all lined out. I can see exactly what I have and it just looks a lot neater to me. And then up there I just keep extra soap and our dog's um, brushes and shampoo and all that stuff. All right, this is the new shower curtain. I love it. Again, I do want to get rid of these floors. My goal is to do that within the next couple months, just to put a different floor down. But for right now, we're just going to have to make do with it. I've thought about getting rid of this thing here that holds our hair dryer, but I really don't know where else I would put them. Because um, I know that they kind of clash, but I really don't have another space for them right now, so we'll just keep them as is. Also, you know, it's nice. I can put them right back in there. Even if the straightener is hot, I can just still throw it in there. It's protected. So, I don't know. For right now, I'm just going to keep it. Towel. And I would love some suggestions, if you guys have any, of what I could put up on the walls. I really don't want anything big. I would just like maybe something up in that corner, maybe something there as well. Um, I just don't really know what to put there. I'm definitely not um, that good with putting up like art. So if you guys have any suggestions, I would love to hear it. This is everything that I got rid of, not including all the trash and extra boxes. And this is what I'm gonna bring to work for my patients.